Всем привет, дорогие друзья, с вами, как всегда, ваш дорогой браток, и сегодня мы с тобой посмотрим на все выборы в Мисс Неудача. Сразу говорю, друзья, я просто частичку души в этот видос сложил, я очень много раз прошел эту игрушку, много раз записывал. Другие лицпойщики, я знаю, как они будут делать, они будут называть свои видосы «Что, если взять рыбу?», «Что, если взять рыбу и отпустить?», вот, вот. Знаешь, вот такие, и столько видосов будет много, но я здесь все выборы просто в одну кучку собрал ради вас, я много времени потратил, много сил, так что надеюсь ты поставишь лайкосик, бро, можешь также, вау, подписаться, это будет супер-супер, вот. Сразу говорю, что вебки тут не будет, конечно же, сейчас я, это все уберется, вот, поэтому, друзья, как бы так, всем я желаю приятного просмотра, приятного аппетита, мы с вами смотрим. Look, this is my secret hiding spot. Oh, impressive. But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. <laughs> I love my coloring book. Nah, I'll just leave it here. For Bubsy, you know, the toddy. I love my coloring book. I'm gonna take it with me if I get bored, okay? This is Bubsy, the guardian. You see his eye? A monster? It was. This is my diary. Look, I made it. This is Kimberly and they're on a tree. <laughs> my glitter. Before you leave, which toy do you choose to bring with you? Can't I take them both? No, you can only choose one. And remember, your choice is much more important than you think. Okay, I choose... I choose the stone that you threw at me once. Interesting choice. Yeah. I call him Stony because he's a stone, get it? <laughs> Stony the stone. That's very clever. Thank you. Ah, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. <laughs> Shadow! <laughs> Happiness to everything! I choose my soft and beautiful unicorn. Perfect. You can never go wrong with a magical unicorn. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> ah, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. <laughs> was a beautiful example of course and please don't tell on me don't worry okay thank you hmm maybe i could try to fix it i'm just gonna leave it there i'm a little lady you know no that was a please don't tell on me don't worry Okay, thank you. Hmm, maybe I could try to fix it. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. I 
did it. Afternoon, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. Good afternoon, morning. Oh. <laughs> I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now throw the ball at it. What ball? This ball. That's all. Okay. <laughs> What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong with you. Sometimes life is just unfair. But I'm here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly, the puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George, is having a party. I think you have to go and tell him about the accident. What accident? Ah, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. I'm sorry I broke you, puppy. I really am. Maybe we can play later. You know, when I'm broken too. <laughs> I'll set it free so we can go to the party. What party? The puppy is obviously going to a sweet party. It, it has a party hat. Ah, yes, the party. I heard George is having one. This must be his dog. So are we going? Yes, why not? It's just a bit farther ahead. Come on, puppy, let's go party. Oh, puppy, I'm petting you. Why do you let me? You like me? It says, no dogs allowed. Oh, really? Oh no, I step on doogie doo. Oh, oh, yeah. Hey, puppy, that's yucky. Don't eat the vomit. Yikes forever. So, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes, that too. You're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it, fast. All right. Mommy told me once, if guys are annoying me, I should kick them in the balls. And I asked, where are these balls? And she said, between the legs. All right. That sounds like a plan. All right, here I go. Oh, kick! Okay, my glitter is shiny. So if I throw glitter at the birds, they will only see shiny. And they will get confused and leave me alone. That sounds like a solid plan, Miss Fortune. All right, here I go. Attack! Uh, 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 this is taking a 
a long time. We didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? Hey, look, a bird. Hello, bird. Oh, that was a rude bird. Why didn't I break my legs and die? Mm, you seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> so, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes. That too. Sweet. Let's go then. Come on, puppy. Puppy, what are you doing? Did you find a treasure? You seem to have found the secret. Shh. The bitch has a secret? Yes. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, look. A fortune treat and a doggy cookie. One for me and one for Papi. Isn't it perfect? Yes, but you can only take one. A cookie for you or a treat for the dog. I mean, I'll take the cookie because I like cookies and they tell your fortune in the cookie. And yeah, I'll take the cookie for me. my cookie now and see my fortune? Yes, go ahead. It says, you are going to die today. Today? But that's today. Hey, didn't you say something about me dying today? No, I told you, Miss Fortune. Nobody said anything like that. And those are just silly cookies. Don't worry about it. Okay. <laughs> I'll take the doggy treat and use it to make the doggy love me. <laughs> Here you go, puppy. You never know when it's your last treat. No, puppy! Puppy, don't go! Puppy! Freaking blackbirds! Oh my, that will make George really upset. Yeah, I hope I get to meet the puppy again sometime. I bet you will. Mr. Voice, why does everyone leave me? I'm still here. Yeah, that's true. Thank you. <laughs> so, Mr. Voice, is the party on the same way to the eternal happiness? Yes. Yes, it is. Ah, oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes. I mean, if you want to. No, I don't want to get in trouble. And I really want to dance at the party. All right, then. Of course, that's the least I can do for the sweet puppy. That is very brave of you, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Oh, look, a boat. Hello. Are we there yet? Just a little bit farther away. Ah, okay. Oh. Ah, a fish. What should we do about it? I would like to return it. It smells fishy. Bye bye, fishy fishy. I'll keep it. His name is Rodrigo and he needs a new place to stay. 
I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know? <laughs> Is answering. I'll invite myself in. Time to check out the party. Nobody's answering. I'll invite myself in. Time to check out the party. Are you sure this is where is the party? Excuse me. I don't know anything. Oh no, wait. Hang himself? No, he's full. Dead? Oh. Hey, Miss Fortune, I'll meet you in the back. George, you're not. Your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Oh, what's this? I guess it's not finished. Nah, I'm not feeling inspired. Okay, I'm here now. Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. Yes! <laughs> Look, I made you a doggy. Not that you need one, but anyways. <laughs> ah, is this the magical cave? It doesn't look that magical. Just wait until you go inside. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> I have a question. What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkle? Ah, cool. So, whenever you're ready. I'll just stay in the forest. But then you won't find the eternal happiness. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, <sighs> oh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. Whoa, hamster fight! Are you going to do something about it? You adorable things, you have to kiss and make up. <laughs> there you go. Oh, please, sweetie, don't go. You dropped something. Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh, no. I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes. Looks like she was robbed. Oh, I bet it was that hamster with the black mask. Yes, you're right. Looks like you helped the criminal escape. Oh, damn it. Does that mean I'm a criminal too? Of course it does. Oh, really? Please don't tell me. Your secret is safe with me. Thank you. Excuse me, do you need assistance? No? Okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, we need to find a way out now. The eternal happiness is still out there. Okay, I'll look around. I wonder what this button does. <laughs> Another bounce. Good job, Miss Fortune. You found the way out. <laughs> Thank you. I'll just hang around <laughs> like a little lady. This 
looks just like a movie I saw on TV. These are the bad guys, I'm telling you. I think you're right. We need to clear the way before we can proceed. But how? You see that fire alarm over there? We need to activate it. Yeah, but how? With a slingshot. What slingshot? This slingshot. Ah, that slingshot, okay. Ah, oh, look, I use these acorns as ammunition. That's really clever, Miss Fortune. <laughs> I know, thank you. Oopsie. That was close. Well done, Miss Fortune. Yay! <laughs> this looks like the science project Daddy has in the basement. I don't know why, but Mommy was really angry about it. That's a lot of cash. Is this the eternal happiness? Oh no. What makes you think that? Mommy said that money is the only thing that makes her happy. Well, your mommy is wrong. Oh, really? Okay. side of the screen. Listen, I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. Will Miss Fortune really die? If so, how will she die? And when will the evil fox kill her? Will she find the eternal happiness? I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act Norma, she's coming. <laughs> I don't want to get involved in their drama. See? They went inside to party. <laughs> it looks like someone spilled their ketchup. <laughs> Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh no, I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes, looks like she was robbed. Oh, I bet it was that hamster with the black mask. Yes, you're right. Excuse me, I think I have your purse. Go easy on the memes, though. I tried one and it was a wild ride. Is that for me? What is it? That's your reward for returning the bag. A VIP ticket for the club. I get to party inside the club? Oh, see. <laughs> yes, and one step closer to the eternal happiness. <laughs> That's a win-win for me. I'm a very VIP. <laughs> Here's my ticket. <laughs> Finally, a real party. Wow, this place is so sweet. Is this the VIP floor? Yes, you could say that. Am I allowed to dance? Of course you are. <laughs> sweet. Listen, Miss Fortune, you need to find the white rabbit. A white rabbit? Why? It will lead you closer to the eternal happiness. Okay, I'll find it. Uh, 
You're cute. So cute. Is that strawberry juice? Mmm, yummy. Excuse me, can you let me through? Hmm, okay. Oh no, Unicorn, what are you doing? Don't be rude now. What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged my Unicorn to a dance battle. No, we don't have time for this. I'm sorry, but I can't stop this now. You can do it, sweet Unicorn. sweet moves. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. The eternal happiness is still out there. Don't you want it? Oh, yes, I really want it. Let's go. Forever. Sucky. No. Bad move. Yes, forever. Ah, oh, sweet unicorn. We need to work on your dance moves. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. The eternal happiness is still out there. Don't you want it? Oh, yes, I really want it. Let's go. Oh, no, Stony, what are you doing? This is not the time. What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged Stony to a dance battle. No, we don't have time for this. I'm sorry, but it's on rock and roll, Stony. <laughs> Great! You're on fire! <laughs> wow, Stony, those moves were awesome! I'm so proud of you! I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. Bad move! Yikes forever! Sucky! Honestly, you rock, but we need to work on your rolling. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. Look, the white rabbit! Follow it. Yes. There's a lot of sweet poetry written on the bench. Death is alive and it's eating from you. Sign M. Mm, interesting. What do you think? <clears throat> Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those poems? Nah. 
Yeah, listen to this one. Both hanging too low. No signature. Where are they hanging from? Oh, look, a drawing of a cat. Come on, Miss Fortune, let's go. All right. Look at the seagull. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Too bad you don't have any fish to offer the seagull. They love fish, you know. Are you trying to make me feel guilty about the fish from earlier? I made a hard decision back there, and I stand behind it. I understand, Miss Fortune. I'm just saying. Well, stop saying. Look at the seagull. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Fascinating. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo? My fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm. I guess that maybe that will be a fair thing to maybe do, I guess. I hope this fish brings you as much joy and love as it did to me. That was very kind of you. Thank you. What? Oh no! Rodrigo is dead now. Of course. Seagulls love eating fish. Why didn't you say something? Well, now you know. Isn't it fun to learn? I guess so. I'll bury him later. If you want a fish friend forever, you need to find your own. Rodrigo is my responsibility. That's very mature of you, Miss Fortune. Would you like to ride the royal horse of the park? Nah, horse swinging is so last year. I see. Would you like to ride the royal horse of the park? Royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. Look at me. I'm on the horse. Aye, horsey, stop it. Oh. Ah, oh, that was unfortunate. Are you all right? I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny and you could break. I broke my arm once. So you know what I mean. <laughs> Check out that duck. Let's just go, Miss Fortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> don't be silly. Ducks are pretty cool. And look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? Nah, I haven't practiced for a while. <laughs> I leave it to the pros. Oh, cute. Cool dancing. Oh. I'm okay, I'm okay. That was unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Of course, check this out. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. That was unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh. If you say so. Would you like to write? Nah, too much 
trolling for the little lady. Would you like to write this one? It's like a tornado. <laughs> yes, I want to ride. My god, stop! Ah, I can't hold up anymore! <laughs> oh no, misfortune. What are you talking about, Miss Fortune? Nothing. So, I was thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Sure, I'm pretty good at answering questions. Great. Just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question, have you ever stolen anything? I stole my friend's Swiss army knife once. I felt so bad, I buried it in the yard and never told him. Oh, I'm so sorry for the both of you. <laughs> Second question, are you happy right now? Yes, I mean, nothing bad is happening right now. That makes me happy. Well then, the last question, do you feel loved? I'm pretty sure mommy loves me because she hasn't left me. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look, we arrived at the pet cemetery. So, I was thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Sure, I'm pretty good at answering questions. Great, just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question, have you ever stolen anything? No, never. Never? Good for you. Second question, are you happy right now? Well, not really. Many things make me sad. That's why I want the price so much. Then I can stop pretending I'm always happy. Ah, I see. Well then. The last question, do you feel loved? No, but my unicorn is telling me that I should work on it. I bet everyone will love me if I was a unicorn. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look, we arrived at the pet cemetery. Ready to find the prize of eternal happiness. Yes, where is it? I have hidden it in one of the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. The goldfish, all right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No, use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. That shovel, okay. This one says, Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> Ugh, smells like hot dogs. I guess it's not the fish. Okay, let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> ah, nothing. Hmm, Stephanie Quinn, writer of the erotic novel. Hmm, <laughs> erotic novel? <laughs> Talk about crazy! Price. How's the grave digging going, Miss Fortune? Good, I got this. It says, Paul died doing what he loved. It's simple. 
Yeah, yikes forever. Ah, uh, no prize in here. Just a bunch of little bones. It says, Yeah, yikes for. Ah, uh, let's see. Roger the magpie. Never saw that window coming. Ha, huh. I don't get it. No prize in here. Look, this grave is available. What do you want to do? There you go. I closed it. Now, nobody can die today. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Congratulate. <gasps> really? Yes. You see the little box? Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. Is this the prize? But there's only a note. What? Yes, it says, I stole your eternal happiness. Signed, Benjamin. Ready to find the prize of eternal happiness. Yes, what is it? I have hidden it in one of the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. The goldfish. All right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No, use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. That shovel, okay. This one says, Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> nah. Okay, let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> No, I don't think this is the fish. Hmm. Stephanie Quinn, writer of the erotic novel Confessions of a Cat. Hmm. Erotic novel? <laughs> Talk about crazy! Nah, this is obviously a cat. It says, Paul died doing what he loved. It's in Pooh. Yeah, yikes forever. Nah, I don't think so. Ah, let's see. Roger the magpie. Never saw that window coming. Ha, huh. I don't get it. Nah, I don't think so. I'll keep looking. Look, this grave is available. What do you want to do? I think I'll bury Rodrigo here. He deserves it. Any last words? Rodrigo smelled like a fish. I like that in a fish. He was nice. I hope he liked me. Bye, Rodrigo. That was beautiful. Thank you. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Nah, too little information. Oh, shake out this stone. It's different from regular stones, I'm telling you. I think you're right. The game of death is what feeds the shadows of the beyond. Huh, what does this mean? That looks like nonsense to me, Miss Fortune. Huh, really? Maybe there's some more nonsense around. Oh, this piece is loose. 
I'll take it for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. Aha, there. That hole looks very much like where the fox would... You mean I should go... Yes, don't worry. Nothing, nothing. But... Okay. I wonder why... Maybe he's not... But I need that hand for mommy. Hello? I... Oh, uh, hello? Fox repellent? I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. his wallet. What do you want to do? I'm gonna take it for me. Open it. Alright, I'm doing it. There's just a picture inside. Really? Can I see? Mm-hmm. It must be his kid. What do you think? Sure, why not? <laughs> I knew it. I'm such a clever little lady. What do you want to do? Wait, sir! You dropped your wallet! Is this for me? A lottery ticket? Cool, thank you. Well, have a look. Is it a winner? Maybe next time. Huh, they know about the missing children here. Okay, this is breakable. Like, like with a rock or something. Like, like a stone. Hmm, I think I came up with an idea. What if... What if I break this window and make a hell of a noise? <laughs> wow, that's a wild idea, but I like it. Thank you. <laughs> oh. So he believes it. A lie, Miss Fortune. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. I mean, that's the only way to get inside. Trust me. All right. Let's go. Hello. Excuse me. There's one of the missing children at the bus stop. I just saw her. You may want to go and check it out. <laughs> 
thank you. Yes, it worked. for birds. I'm a little lady, you know. It's not what a little lady does. Simple as that, okay? Okay, Miss Fortuna. I'll take the seeds because I want to feed the birds so they're not hungry. your food. I love you. Somehow I feel offended by this. Don't be. It doesn't know what it's doing. Okay. Berda, Berda. Come, Berda. Eat your food, Berda, Berda. Is your name Berda? <laughs> Berda. <laughs> Look. This bird seems pretty smart. It isn't. Trust me. Move on, Miss Fortune. Okay. There you go. Mm. Robert and Mary, are you enjoying the food? <laughs> you like it? Oh my. Looks like this area is closed to the public. Oh, damn it. You will have to sneak past the janitor to get to the other side. Don't let her see you. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mommy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. I could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm ready. Let's do this. Like a little ninja lady. Well done, Miss Fortune. Now, wait for her to turn her back to you and... And then kill her from behind? What? No. Why? That's what the ninjas do in movies. I've seen, like, all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well, this isn't a movie, so just do as I say. When she turns around, you can jump out and keep moving. Ah, uh, all right then. It just looks a lot cooler on TV. Oh. I'm like the Shadow Ninja Master. She never saw me. Don't celebrate just yet. There's one more box you have to sneak past. You better watch me when I nail this one. like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> oh look, it fit. The path to Sonar City is twisted by the malevolent games from the beyond. What? A path twisted to where? Don't pay any attention to these silly rocks. Nobody's us coming. You really proved your ninja skills back there, Miss Fortune. But I'm pretty sure I was the best at hiding back there. No, that doesn't count. You're not a little lady like me. You're just a boy. Oh, you'll see. I'm much, much... Like a little ninja lady. Well done. Now... And then kill her from me. What? No. That's what the ninjas don't tell mommy. Well... This, when she turns around... Ah, uh, 
All right, then. It just looked a little... Ah, oh, damn it. My ninja move failed. Oh, man. We got caught by the cops. Busted by the law. We should get out of here and find the wolf. All right. Inside. We need to find a key. Look around. All right. Other round of questions while we walk. Sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question Have you ever heard this question before? Yes. All right. Second question Have you ever lied? To a friend. I do it all the time in school. Charlene still believes my daddy comes and picks me up after school. I just walk behind the trees and sneak home when she's not watching. That's so sad. If you say so. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? I saw Grandad die. It was very calm, not like in the movies, it was different. I told him to come haunt me as a ghost, but he hasn't done it yet. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting! Sure, my question answering skills are all warm up. Great, great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? Uh, you mean this one? Yes, I have not heard that question before. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? No, uh, I swear. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. Now. For the last question, have you ever seen someone die? Other than in ninja movies? No. <laughs> they die in funny ways in ninja movies. Don't tell mommy. I won't. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting! Check out those sweet unicorns! Look, little baby sweet unicorn! This is your family. Say hello. Did you say? Okay. Now say bye-bye, and we'll go. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Yes. All right then. Have a pleasant ride. so good. I'm feeling this. You think you're going to puke? I don't want to, but the ride went too fast. It was fun. All right, good. Take a deep breath and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good, good. Now, let's go find that boat. The boat? <sighs> okay, I'm okay. Oh, sweet. That haunted house must be terrifying. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Yes. All right then, have a pleasant ride.
Oh, I don't feel so good. I'm feeling this. You think you're going to puke? I don't want to. But the ride went too fast. It was fun. All right, good. Take a deep breath and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good, good. Now, let's go find that boat. That boat? <gasps> okay, I'm okay. This one is free. I want to play it. Oh, please do play it. Play it as much as you want. Really? All right. Well, check this out. Now with real bullets. Fancy. I... I think I broke the game. It looks like it. Oh. Check this out. I can get a reward ticket if I win. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. Please, go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about. Are these tiny foxes? They're dangerous foxes. Pretend they all stole your eternal happiness and whack them. Whack them! Okay. Fucking misfortune. <laughs> Oops. Cat <laughs> <Head> down. Cat <laughs> down. Hello, I'm Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez, and I want to know the future of me. Please, thank you. <laughs> Once you see the beyond, the beyond sees you, and you can be sure it will be coming for you. <gasps> the beyond is coming for me? <laughs> What's the beyond? Want to try again? Yes, again. What you see in the beyond is not what you see, but what you don't see. Oh, really? <laughs> Talk about crazy. Want to try it again then? Okay, okay, again. You are being lied to at this very moment. Trust me, Mimi. Don't trust anything. Ah, oh, really? Who is lying to me? Is Benjamin lying to me? <gasps> what? Oh no, too bad. Yes, poor little birdie. Maybe he was flying drunk. You know, like my mommy did once and crushed daddy's car. Like this little birdie crushed with its body, you know? Yes, I get it, Miss Fortune. It's still sad. It crushed. Check those sweet rewards. A golden chocolate coin, a cute tiny skirt, and a doll. Oh, sweet. Let's see what I can get. <laughs> I know who will look amazing in this tiny skirt. 
Shut up! <laughs> Where you go, unicorn? You look like a sweet little lady. Tiny cool hat. Shut down! <laughs> there you go, Stony. You look like a rock star. Oh, what's a freaking Kraken? Hey, this place is very quiet. Is one allowed to talk? Anyway, I was thinking, is the Kraken available for petting? You know, like uh, some pet doggies, some pet kitties. I want to pet the Kraken, if it's possible. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Look, I only have Rodrigo's bones. Let's see what happens. Uh, bye, Rodrigo. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Look, Rodrigo, we need to talk. I don't know what the Kraken is, but I'm very curious. So I'll just place you here and see what happens. Rodrigo! <gasps> what is this? And there's the Kraken. Can we pet the Kraken now? I think you missed your opportunity. Ah, uh, just my luck. But hey, don't be sad. We're getting close to the eternal happiness. I've been hearing that all day. It's not my fault. The fox stole it. Ah, uh, yeah, right. I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Well, I don't have any fish on me. I guess I won't be petting the Kraken. Was that the fish from the bridge? <laughs> I think he's happy because I saved him. You remember I saved him from the bridge, remember? Yes, I remember. Did you see the kiss he gave me? <laughs> On my mouth? Because he was in love with me. Because I saved him. <laughs> Somebody loves me. Check this out, Stony. This is your family, see? From the woods. Say hello. And now, say bye-bye, baby Stony, because we're leaving. running away from? Is it the fox? I'm pretty sure it was the fox. No, it's the monster. I saw it again. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I saw it. Don't make any sudden moves. Filthy paws, you beast. Stop it. You're scaring him away. Don't leave, Benjamin. Don't make any sudden moves. Don't 
Archer, with your filthy paws, you beast. Stop it. You're scaring him away. Don't leave, Benjamin. Please, Miss Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me, he's dangerous. Stop running, please. Really? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, you'll end up hurt? Uh-huh. I know, I could have been more specific, like, there's a bear trap up ahead, stop or you will be hurt. But I felt like getting straight to the point. Okay, okay, thank you. Who left a bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox also. I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. <laughs> All right. Mm. All right. <sighs> Thank you. That could have ended badly. Now, watch your step. There's a bear trap up ahead. You don't want to get stuck in one of those. Hurts like hell. Who will leave a bear trap here? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox. Also, I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this one looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> it's stuck. Huh. The elimination of Prime Eve will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really interesting. What are you doing? Nothing. So, Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? Yes, yes, I do. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. And in my secret spot, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magical, don't you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, it is, my sweet child. Moving on, second question. Do you trust me? I guess. I can only hear you in my head. And I trust my own head, so yeah. That makes me so happy to hear, Miss Fortune. Well, anyway. Now, for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? Yes. I am. I don't know if I will like being dead. It's like, too mysterious, you know? What if I can't bring my glitter? Well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know? Hey, look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure that 
foxes hidden the eternal happiness here. Make sure the cabin is empty, and if you see the fox, run. All right. So, Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? No. That is said, the only magic came from acid. But the only acid I know is when I lick batteries. <laughs> hmm. Second question. Do you trust me? Nah, you're just a voice in my head. Mommy talks to herself a lot too. She says it's her inner demons and that they just keep them away. I'm sorry to hear that. Hey, are you my inner demon? Me? A demon? <laughs> no. Nah, you can't be a demon. Not with that silly voice. <laughs> well, anyway. Now, for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? No, I'm not afraid of death because all, all, all dead people I know never came back from being dead. So it must be pretty cool to be dead. <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't... I'm a little lady. Ah, oh, what a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? I'm just gonna have a little look inside. By Benjamin Johanalius Red Fox. I knew his name was Benjamin. So Benjamin's not from open fields? I bet he has an accent. I love that in a fox. Parasite, you say? Who are the victims? What game? Benji's afraid of the parasite. Oh, poor Benji. Hmm. Missing? A voice? It's a monster! Big trouble? Misfortune? But that's me. I bet he's in love with me. All this again? Oh, shake out Benji's stick. Hmm, yes, I know how to talk. He loves me. If Benji has a boss, he has a job. Then I can be married to him. She smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend. Because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Mmm. It definitely tastes like his fluffy paws. Mmm. Delicious. Ugh. I feel weird. happiness you stole. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. 
We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Your diary. I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it the monster in your diary you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. You can't hide the children. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? Like if I was a girl in trouble? player Fonsu Let's see Benjamin's on TV <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. Maybe I can fix it. Cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? I won't spy on Benjamin's personal stuff. Mmm, that tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Hmm, Mr. Voice said that I shouldn't trust a fox. <gasps> Benjamin! I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry. You can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Is that your diary? You want me to read it? Is that what you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. You can't hide the children. I'm not supposed to follow you. I'm sorry. You! You are the one taking the children, aren't you? Don't you come any closer! I like to play forever. Mr. Voice? <laughs> oh, I wish I had my coloring book with me. Oh. Hello, Hiro. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? I know Hira. What does it mean? It's the monster! Leave Hira alone! Tuskata! Tuskata!
Let's go. I know Hira. What does it mean? It's the monster. Leave Hira alone. Toskata! Toskata! I don't feel inspired. Ugh. Oh, no. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, sweet unicorn. Please take me to your rainbow kingdom. Ah! So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. Not Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, Stomley, teach me how to be brave. Ah! So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. Oh, 
video player. Fancy. Let's see. Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. Maybe I can fix it. over now. Benji? Who are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. Nice. 